update thanks for downloading Velvet Sky Time. Please follow our simple guide for installing and customizing the time. Velvet Sky Time has some features like Presta Shop 1.4.1.0 compatible, custom homepage, two columns of fixed switch, horizontal menu and submenu integration, custom slideshow module, combo slider on homepage, one page and guest checkout supported, and custom advertisement block. Okay, now we unzipping Velvet Sky Temp and copy the content of the temps and then copy the content of modules. You can configure the store appearance by logging to your PrestaShop admin panel. Now we on the back office section. Click on preferences. And then click appearance. On appearance section, you can upload different type of logos for your store. Upload the image to header logo. This image will appear on the store page. Upload logo image to mail logo and invoice logo. This image will appear on email and invoice header. Upload your image to five icon. This image will appear in the address bar of your web browser. Upload your image to the store icon. This image will appear on the store locator inside the Google Maps. And then save. On theme section, choose the Velvet Sky theme and don't forget to click the save button. Velvet Sky theme uses custom modules like block advertising home, block banner, JMS block, newsletter block, user info block, wishlist block, combo slider on the home page. Julian Brooks Horizontal Menu, Products Category, and jQuery Nipple Slider. Some of these modules need to be configured to make it work. To configure module position, go to Modules, open Search and Filter tab, and then uninstall Quick Search block. We don't need this module since we will have it from Julian Brooks Menu module. Open front office features and find Julian Burke's menu and install this module and then click configure. To add a menu in add menu box, do as the following. Type. Choose one of the desired menu item type. Parent item. This one will show the menu list which has been created or had exist before. Choose the parent item for the item to be listed as a child menu. JSS ID. This option will come in handy if you want to have distinctive menu in the menu list. Title. Fill the desired title for created menu. It will show as the menu in the item menu list. Must be logged. Check if you want to restrict unregistered members to access the menu. Icon. Upload the icon for the menu. Now we choose position and rearrange module in the top of page as shown in image. For attention. Please uninstall the quick search block module and make sure that JBX menu module position at the bottom. To configure module position on home page, install these following modules. jQuery Nuvo slider. Combo slider on the home page. Block advertising home and block newsletter. And 
uninstall these modules. Home text editor and feature products on the home page. jQuery Nipo slider used to add image in home page slider. First, open the front office feature tab and click configure on jQuery Nipo slider. You can add up to four image on the slideshow. Default size for the slideshow image is 940 times 404 pixel. For attention, all uploaded image will be stored in slash module slash slider rig folder and automatically renamed as n0.jpg, n1.jpg, n2.jpg, and n3.jpg, respectively. Two letters EN in front of each number is the language ISO code. If you install other language, then you need to copy the image and nlinks.xml and rename it with the appropriate ISO code. Combo slider on home page. Used to set number of products to display. Open the front of its feature tab and click configure on combo slider on home page block advertising home used to add advertising image and link open the advertising and marketing tab and click configure on block advertising home block newsletter used to configure newsletter block open the front of its features tab and click configure on block office newsletter home page content module position go to modules and then we choose position and rearrange module in home page content as shown in image. Modules on top of page. Block banner used to add advertising image on top of page and link. Open the advertising and marketing tab. Find block banner module and click configure. Modules on footer. CMS block to modify the dynamic content open the front office feature and click configure on CMS block for attention open the modules slash block cms slash block cms .tpl file to change the static content and links okay now modules on sidebar in admin panel click modules and then click position and then transplant all the modules required for this time by clicking the transplant module link Position of modules in right column. Remove all of the modules in right column blocks and transplant it. In the left column blocks, if you need it. Okay, good luck for the installation. Find more information to manage your PrestaShop store at prestashop.com or you can ask to contact at doublepixel.com. We are happy to respond any queries, comments, or issues you might have. Terima kasih.